Hello, awesome community. I am Jamit, serverless developer and AWS community builder. Welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to demonstrate AWS Lambda recently launched a new feature AWS Lambda function URLs. So that support a built in um, uh, HTTPS endpoint to call a Lambda function directly without using API gateway in between. So it is kind of like hot feature launched with the Lambda. So let us, uh, 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 let me show you the uh, demo regarding the same, how you can use that uh, built in uh, Lam Lambda function uh, URLs. So first of all, let us create one new Lambda function. Uh, you can create, uh, uh, you can uh, go to the compute section and click on Lambda or you can search here Lambda uh, from the top bar. So go to the Lambda section, click on create function. And here you can uh, select this uh, from, we are creating function from scratch, giving the function name, let's say Lambda endpoint demo. And uh, for now, I'm selecting runtime on uh, You can select your choice runtime. Uh, in advanced setting, uh, recently launched this new feature, enable uh, function URL. So uh, as soon as you like, uh, you are able to uh, link, uh, uh, you are able to add a function URL for your Lambda function. So you, that you then, up by using that URL, you are, you are directly able to call your Lambda function. So let me enable uh, this function URL for particular this demo function, demo Lambda function. So it is giving us a different options to select like related to authentication. If you want to create a public uh, endpoint to call a Lambda function, uh, inbuilt um, uh, function URL for Lambda function publicly, then you need to select none or type. So it will be uh, publicly available to call uh, by using that function URL, you are publicly able to call the Lambda function. And if you want to do some authentication with IAM, IAM uh, users, then you need to select that particular type. Okay. And it is also providing some configuration rela relevant to cores for passing headers for your endpoints. Okay. So for now, let me create a public uh, endpoint for this Lambda function, built in end endpoint for this Lambda function. So uh, let, let me create that function. So as soon as Lambda function get created, it will have a function URL link with it. So by using that function URL HTTP endpoint, we are directly able to call Lambda function without using uh, API gateway in between. So it's kind of uh, really uh, something hot feature launched with uh, Lambda recently on uh, this uh, 6th April of 2022. Okay, uh, so here you can see like this as this Lambda function is created, uh, Lambda endpoint demo, new Lambda function is created. Uh, in default code, we have like uh, a Node.js runtime default code and returning hello from Lambda in the code level. And uh, you can see like this function URL, this is a new section added. So here, uh, this Lambda function is already linked with this endpoint function URL. So, uh, 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 let me copy this uh, URL and now I am able to directly call this Lambda function by using this function URL uh, without using API gateway. So let me open Postman. So this Postman is really good tool uh, for uh, calling APIs, building collection and all those things to invoke the endpoints. So let me, uh, I copied this function, Lambda function endpoint and uh, running it in the Postman as a get call. So here you can see like we get the response hello from Lambda. So that is written it uh, uh, from our Lambda function uh, code. Uh, you can see hello from Lambda. So that we get that response uh, from our Lambda function. Uh, so this is a, you can see like there is, there is a ran some random token then Lambda URL uh, region and then some like uh, this is kind of like URL pattern for a Lambda URL uh, function URL. So API getaway have some different URL, okay. So here we are calling Lambda function directly by using Lambda URL, Lambda function URL instead of API gateway in between. So this is a public URL. So we are directly able to access that. Uh, now, uh, right now there is no any authentication implemented here. Uh, and uh, 
and now if you want to change this uh, function url and want to introduce the authentication in between by using I, I, iam then we are able to do in the configuration section uh, recently this new section is added you can see here mark is a new so this function url is a new section added here uh, it will uh, uh, displaying already at is the at already at is the function url authentication type is none so that is why you can see like this function is available uh, without any authentication so we are directly getting response without any authentication here and so that auth type none uh, like now if we want to change this function url and we want to do uh, uh, like some authentication uh, uh, then and only allowed to call that function uh, so i am doing iam based authentication okay uh, instead of like publicly available endpoint so let me save it so now this endpoint is secured um, instead of publicly available uh, you can see like what type is uh, uh, aws iam so now let me call this function uh, so instead of uh, let me again cross check like what exactly happening uh, uh, let me uh, again copy that url uh, once uh, once again okay so this is the same uh, function i edited it i am using that uh, odd type aws i am let me go back to the lambda function and let me hit it again now you can see right uh, this is an uh, forbidden uh, so means because what happened here in configuration function url is is before it was public but now we changed in edit section we change this odd type to uh, AWS IAM. So now this uh, Lambda function URL is a secured URL uh, authenticated through I IAM instead of uh, publicly available. So now I am calling this without any authentication. So it me it's showing forbidden access. Okay. Uh, but uh, if we want to uh, uh, like uh, if you want to uh, like right now it is forbidden because we did not passing any authorization uh, here. So if we want to make it uh, like right now waiting is uh, I am secure. So let me uh, show you how you can uh, create it. Uh, you can go to uh, you can go to the I am section. And you can create uh, one new role, a uh, new user. Uh, uh, say for, uh, let me uh, create it. Uh, let me go to the uh, uh, let me create like Lambda endpoint demo for now as a username and i am giving a programmatic access for this i am attaching the policy uh, lambda uh, full access for now and reviewing it at and attaching this lambda uh, aws lambda full access for now for particular this user okay so these are some details i am getting uh, that that detail i will use uh, as a part of uh, so this is a uh, this when you are in create i am user it will give you access key and secret key okay so that access key and secret key uh, you need to uh, use uh, uh, so here uh, how how in in postman right now it is giving a forbidden because you have that i am authentication so here you need in authorization section in postman you need to use this aws signature for authentication okay and you require to pass here uh, you require to pass here whatever new user you created uh, that user uh, related uh, secrets okay that uh, secrets and access key id and in and, and in advanced section also you need to pass the region right now i am giving ap south one region because i am calling from that and uh, also service name you need to give the lambda uh, and uh, region you need to give whatever region you are and you need to pass access key and secret key of uh, whatever i am user you created and after that you can uh, invoke this function 
so you can see like now now i am get, we are getting this response hello from lambda instead of access forbidden okay because we are giving a, a right authorization detail through aws signature so we are passing in authorization we are passing aws signature by using access key and secret key of that iim user okay so this way we are able to uh, use the uh, lambda function url um, http endpoint authenticated with iim as well as publicly available according to uh, our requirement okay so uh, so that way and there are also available some core configuration like you are able unable to uh, enable it uh, and you, you are able to allow origin specific one for a more security and all those kind of header passing and other options are available relevant to course so you are also able to use course as a part of this lambda function url uh, 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 http endpoint so this is a really really cool uh, new feature uh, launched with the um, lambda uh, lambda aws lambda recently that is kind of really game changer for uh, serverless and uh, like it is kind of like without api gateway we are able to call any lambda function uh, by using this uh, function uh, url okay so this uh, in, in, whenever you create any new lambda function you will have option to uh, enable a lambda function url or you are also able to uh, go to the configuration and from this uh, function url section for existing lambda you are also able to add this function url for your lambda uh, with like a public uh, authentic public or a authenticated through iam so this is a really cool aws function url feature uh, that support http endpoints to execute your lambda function without api gateways it's kind of like a really cool feature so that's that is a, just a demo uh, about uh, this feature so for now we are uh, calling this so um, if i will uh, uh, yeah this is like i just demonstrated both the uh, uh, authentication like public as well as uh, authenticated to iam okay so uh, this is the uh, complete demo about um, lambda function url http endpoint to call a lambda function directly without using api gateway hope you uh, enjoy this session uh, 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 look, uh, hope you enjoy this session and uh, I'm happy you can share this uh, session with uh, some other enthusiastic AWS learner and uh, uh, please like, share and subscribe my channel for a more such technical session. Thank you so much for your time uh, for watching this session. Yeah, thanks.